because we're out here at Wet n Wild Hawaii. We've got to talk about what you wear in the water. So I've changed clothes. I don't look nearly as cute as these ladies who are wearing Siren Song. And we have the designer here with us, Jamie DeVay Collins. Good morning to you. Good morning. Now she spent a lot of time on the North Shore, so you know that wearing these types of things, you don't want to wear the bulky black wetsuits that you normally see, right? That's kind of how you got this idea. Right. I was tired of that. I wanted something beautiful and feminine and I just couldn't find what I wanted on the market. So I decided to make it myself. Okay. So these are great for surfing or for snorkeling or for diving even. Pretty much any water sport, wakeboarding, kiteboarding, surfing, you name it. Okay. So she sells them online. So we thought we'd give you guys an idea of what you can expect from her design. So what do we have up first? Okay, well, we've got Rose. She's got the pink scallops. Um, it's got a cute little ruffle on the back, and this is kind of a siren song signature, the ties on the side. I love the ties. Thanks. And then here we've got this is the blue and purple chevron, which is, um, this is one of my most popular ones. People love this. And then a crop top, which is great for summer here in Hawaii. It gets so hot, you don't necessarily want to wear a full wetsuit, so. Mm -hmm. Crop top's perfect for summer. And then at the end there, we've got the gingham. And that's a design that I came up with myself. If you actually zoom in on it, it's got all these quotes about the ocean. And oh, okay. So, so the whole idea of a wetsuit is usually to stay warmer in water, but right. these are so, look more like a one piece. Do they still keep you guys warm? You know, it, it yeah. looks like a swimsuit, but it's two to three millimeter neoprene. Uh, it does the job. Okay, and then how much do these go for? Um, between 180 and 250. Okay, and where can you get them? Um, well, I've got my website at www.sirensongwetsuits.com, and I'm also doing an Indiegogo campaign, which wraps up tomorrow, actually. So. And what is that? Um, it's a fund, a crowdfunding campaign, and so people can donate money and in return they get perks and so there's pre-orders and hats and all kinds of cool siren song swag. So when you're looking at these as beautiful as they look you gotta imagine that because they're made of neoprene they're not the easiest to make or to sew. You had to find certain types of threads, certain types of needles right. to use, right? Yeah, it was a challenge learning how to do it. Um, but I've got it down now. I've figured it out. The right needles, the right thread, the right sewing machine. Okay, and are they comfortable ladies? Yes. Yes. Have you been in the water? Yes. yes. Okay, well you guys can check it out yourself. It is called Siren Song. You can find it online. They are the new thing in female wetsuits. So, coming up, we're gonna be getting wet and wild on the rides. I've been trying to avoid it all morning, but I think it's my time to go on the Wynette Coaster. Thank you so much for coming Thanks in. Thanks for having me on. I really appreciate it. Oh, absolutely. We're going to be right back with more Sunrise on the Road.